Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video is very exciting. It's featuring this Me. random man I found on the street. Yes. What's your name? I was on, uh, Philip. <laughs> Addison. Addison. This is my fiance, but maybe by the time this is published, he'll be my husband. True. So anyways, today's video, we're doing a live taste test because I have achieved the greatest achievement <laughs> of my entire influencer career, which is I got on Bitch and Sauce's PR list. So if you're not aware of Bitch and Sauce, it's a sauce that is found at Costco. Oh wait, hang on. First of all, this is not a paid ad at all. Like they no. sent me these dips for free, but I'm choosing to make a video on them because of how much I love their freaking sauce. It is very good. And it's actually a pretty healthy dip. It, it, it's, it's made like from- It's like an almond dip. Addison proceeded to read the entire ingredient list. You it's an I mean? almond based sauce, which sounds like it would be gross, but so we have had the Chipotle one, which is what I found at Costco, fell in love with it. Then they also have it at Target. And then we actually just tried their original sauce the other day, but we'll still taste them part as part of this taste test to give you an idea of what it tastes like. Um, I don't even know where you can really buy these. I've only seen them at Costco and Target. So each one will be a surprise. So we will start off by, I guess, the original. Is this a coupon? I don't know. Oh, <laughs> you know what? You can get it at Whole Foods too. You can get it at Whole Foods. That's cool. This is Never original do. sauce, huh? Original, bitchin' original. and saucy. All right, so what we like to do, I don't know if this is standard, but we love to eat it with pita chips. These are just regular. We often get the Parmesan garlic ones, but we <laughs> wanted to make this just like all about the sauce today. You know, all about the sauce. We're gonna try them, we're gonna rate them. We're gonna so rate them out of 10. What the best sauce is. So this is original. Here's right. the texture. It's kind of thick. It's thick. All right. I don't know. It's got like a, what's the word I'm looking for? I don't know. Rich texture, like almost like a, not spicy. It's, it's really good. This is actually, so That's I, I love this. This is that I've tried. I haven't tried any of these other than the original and Chipotle. That's rated at the same time, so we're not influenced. Just so you know, this is like water, almonds. They don't need the ingredient juice. list. <laughs> okay, do you want to rate it then? I love this sauce. It's very good. Original. I'm the country. It's got a slight like. It's got like a kick. It's not spicy it, though. Just not a kick. Spi not spicy. Just like a yeah. All right, ready? One, two, three. Nine. Eight. Wow, a nine. An eight? It's really good. It's your favorite. You said. Out of two, I can't just give it a nine out of ten off the start. That would be unreal. So that's original. Love it. Next up, my personal favorite out of the two we've tried is Chipotle. This one's oh, already open. She's <laughs> chips. She's trying to get in on this pita chip action. This is Chipotle. Chipotle. You want to dink it oh, and sink it? Just it. like good. You know, we love. I love. Okay, it. Chipotle. Yeah. Difference between original and Chipotle. This tastes smokier. Yeah, it's got the Chipotle pepper, which is kind of a smoky pepper. I love it. I like to put it on eggs in the morning. Yeah. It's phenomenal. Even though the dips are like made out of almonds, they don't taste like almonds at all in the slightest whatsoever for me. If you like Chipotle flavoring, you'll love this. Even mm -hmm. if you, you're like, oh, Chipotle is okay. Like I like this better than other Chipotle. I usually don't like Chipotle flavored stuff and I love this. So. Are you ready to rate it? Go ahead. I'll wait for you to Count chew. down. One, two, three, nine and Eight a half. Eight and a half. Ah, you. I just decided right now it's a little bit better because I like the flavor. There's a lot more flavor to it. Next up, let me sort these. There's two sweet ones and we will do sweet last. Next up. Stop, it's gonna fall because of your face. Oh. The bitchin' pesto sauce. I love pesto. You used to not like pesto. Ooh, this one's thicker. Addison used to hate pesto. And then he realized he likes it. Yeah, I used to not like basil very much, I guess, but now I really like basil. So I'm gonna mix this one. It's a little, ooh, this one's thicker. Oh, Maisie just licked my chip. All right, you're fired. You're out of the video. Yeah, so now I'm assuming this one's gonna taste like pesto. <laughs> it smells like basil. 
I'm we, actually very excited for we this. We grow fresh basil in our garden. Yeah. I used to not know what pesto was made from before I started cooking. I think it just scared me. It's like, what is this? But now, I love it. Ready? Dink it, sink it. That's good. It literally it's tastes like pesto. straight pesto. Like, I feel, like, if you just dip this in pesto. Like, I would put this on pasta, actually. They did a good job making this taste like pesto. I, I needed a little bit more. I mean, it's basil, right? Basil. That's good. It's good. It's good. It's not something I could eat every day, though. Ready? Okay. One, two, three, seven. seven. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty, it's like it's good. But it's like good. she said, you have to be like ready for pesto, right? You're not going to be like... Ready for pesto. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Next stuff. My face is a minute. Cilantro chili. You excited? This is probably what I'm most excited for. I don't know why the cilantro. I like cilantro. Like I like. Is there a lime? Is it like cilantro lime? Isn't no. that what I said? Cilantro chili. Oh. So I don't know. That's interesting. It's green. So I assume there would be lime in it. All right. Oh, I ripped a bag. All right. This one is also thick. This is like as thick as the pesto one, probably. I'm not sure what to expect out of this. Do I get a smell? I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> we should have done this blindfolded and then tasted it to see if we can tell the flavor. That's true. And I want a practical. Cilantro chili. I just don't know what to expect. Me neither, man. Like, it doesn't really have much of a scent either. That... Bang it, <laughs> slang it. Um. You know what? That cilantro came through way more than I expected because I didn't smell it. You know what? But it came through hard. That's phenomenal. I like that. Yeah. It has jalapeno in it, it says, but it doesn't, it's not spicy. I like it a lot. Actually, I think the original even has jalapeno in it, by the way. No, one of them does not. <laughs> it's not that good though to me. I don't know. It's, I, for some reason, I'm a little underwhelmed. Like I'm just when getting like it, cilantro and cilantro by itself. When I eat it without the chip, I get a lot of cilantro flavor. I like it. Okay. Go ahead, count it down. One, two, three, six Seven and a and half. half. Really? You didn't like it's it? It's my least favorite so far. Interesting. All right, should we do spinach artichoke or Bombay? Spinach artichoke. Bombay is, I have no idea what Bombay is. I don't know what is. Bombay means. To be honest, I've never had something like that, so that would be a big curveball at the end. Maisie, you're done. You licked my chip. You're not coming up anymore. <laughs> Oh, that is thick. A little bit. She's back. So next up is spinach artichoke. It's not as green as I was expecting it to be. These are Amazing. very difficult. It's not for you. It doesn't smell like anything. Sorry. Right? Um, bang it, slang it. <laughs> it's sweet. Yeah. What? what the heck just happened? It's sweet. I'm a big one. <laughs> Read them off. Go. Maybe it's a coconut. There's coconut. Why what? is there coconut in I it? I don't know, but I mean, there is spinach and artichokes, but then it's co there's coconut added. It's good. It's definitely good. I'm just like, to me, like nothing screams spinach artichoke. And let me try it one more time. I, I get don't a know. Lot it's not kid. for me. It's really not for me. I would never, like, I won't buy this again. I probably won't even eat this again. All right, are you ready? Yeah. One, two, three, four. four. Nice. Banging it and slanging it. <laughs> it's, honestly, if it was salty, maybe it'd be good. Sweetness. You need to cleanse, cleanse your palate. Sure. <laughs> salty one. This is called Bombay. Here it is. It's like yellowy. What does it smell like? It smells like tiki masala, which mm -hmm. Indian is like one of my favorite takeout foods. I get sag paneer. I get butter chicken. He gets, Sadie, he gets butter chicken. I get sag paneer. And it kind of smells like that. It's got like curly, curry powder, garlic. Curly powder. Curly. <laughs> Bang it and swing it. It smells really good. Yeah, I'm actually excited. It smells good. Ooh, that is good. It kind of does taste like mm -hmm. tiki masala. Got it, yeah. 
I really like that. You have to like, you know, the curry powder, you know what I mean? You have to kind of like that curry flavor. Yeah. Like, you know, but has I a, love it, so I love this. This is really good. has a very strong curry taste, but I love curry. Loads better than the spinach artichoke one. Okay, do you have your score ready for Bombay? Ready? Wait. Your turn. My turn? Okay. Your turn. Your mine? Go for it. One, two, three, Nine. seven point eight. Nine? I loved it. You gave it a, you like this better than Chipotle? Pull out the Chipotle. Gosh dang it. This is We hard. need a direct comparison. Alright, so let's do the sweets and then we're gonna pull out our three favorites and then okay. taste test them at the very end just to make sure we are right. This is so specific, maybe it shouldn't be nine. I might be wrong. I don't know. That is good though. Two sweets. Here we go. Alright. We're gonna be using Graham cracker sticks. We got sweet chocolate and caramel. What do you want first? Whatever you want. Chocolate. Ooh, that's chocolatey. I got a couple These sticks. These are also made out of almonds. Oh wow, yeah, that is. Oh, it's kind of like it's did it get on you? A little bit. Sorry. <laughs> Like wow, that. the texture of this one's way different. Yeah, it's it like it looks different. It looks like pudding. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it looks fantastic. It looks like a chocolate ganache. It really does. Like well, it's pretty thick. Oh, right. I hang on. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to smell it. That smells good. All right. What is it? You say it. I forgot it. Bang it and slang it. Bang it and slang it. That's phenomenal. Mm. Like, it kind of just tastes like pudding. It tastes like a brownie batter before yes, it's cooked. It does, because it kind of has like a grainy texture to it. It's literally a brownie batter before it's cooked. Holy hell, they should sell that as like advertised as brownie batter. It shouldn't be called chocolate sauce. It should be called brownie batter. That's so good. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. Me too. One, two, oh wait, no, you call, you go. One, two, three, nine. Nine point eight. That's an easy nine. Solid nine. Oh, it's not you a super are doing it strong. a disservice by giving it a nine. What would, be, what would make it a ten for you? Like it's not quite strong as like the brownie batter flavor. Like the chocolate doesn't come through it quite as much as I would like. Lick it. <sighs> I'm dead. Like it's still a little like. He's crazy. I didn't know if bitch and sauce could do sweet dips, but turns out. They can. They can. They can. Oh, that's so almond. Yeah, it's still like an almond base. And too. I think that I would rate that higher than the other ones because I'm more of a sweets person naturally. And just to give you like an idea, servings, calories per servings, like I think all the savory, salty ones are like nine or 120 or 110. These are. That one's 90. Oh, sorry. The sweet or the salty, savory are 90. <laughs> The sweet are 110, 120, something yeah. like that. You know what I mean? So not really much of a difference. 10, 20 per serving, whatever. Who cares? All right. Like, What's this next one we got? Salted caramel, right? Is it salted caramel? I believe it's. I don't like salted. No. Oh, it is, is it salted, salted caramel? caramel? I Wait. love salted caramel flavor. This is salted caramel. I don't like salty flavors. That's thin. Bang it. Bang it. And slang it. And slang it. It's good. Actually. I'm gonna need to lick it. I feel like it is. You gotta much. lick it. None the graham cracker sticks are really good for these sweet ones. Mm hmm It's not even that caramely to me either. Like it's caramely, but not like I think it tastes caramely. It's very light, which is good. Like you could probably eat a ton of this and not get <laughs> on my thigh. Maybe you don't. No, man, you don't, don't you dare. Ready? Do I count? Yes. One, two, three, Nine. seven and a half. It's just okay. I it was good. Like it was, this seven and a half is a really good score, honestly. The chocolate is the winner of the sweet for sure. That is delish. Brownie batter all the way. It's phenomenal. Bitch and sauce, if you're watching this, rename this to brownie batter. Yeah, you market that differently. We're bringing out the three salty, savory ones. Just to test our three favorites. We got original, mm -hmm. Chipotle, and Bombay. I think I'm gonna stand behind my rankings. Give me some pita chips. Because I am my mind is broken. I give that a nine. Mm -hmm. Eight and a half, eight. So first, second, third. Yeah, I'm surprised. It's very good. I love it. I like that because you like you don't have to be like craving anything and just 
You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like it's just like These salty. These are very specific flavors that you like kind of have to be in the mood for. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Chipotle? Not necessarily. Chipotle I'm always in the mood for. I could drink it. I mean, that one, the Chipotle is just so, like the flavor is so strong and good. Let me try it again. Do you still like the Chipotle? But I could, I could eat. Original? It's not about what you could eat, it's about what I could eat that way more than I could, like, you know what I mean? I could down half this bottle before I could down that. But if I was doing just one, that one would be like... You say bottle? What? Tub? Tub. Tub. <laughs> I'd down like half that can in one sitting. I couldn't do you much. Can. Tub. Half that tub in one sitting. I could do like a few of these chips because the flavor is so strong. But if you're doing just one chip, the Chipotle is going to do you right. Better. So Let's do you see him by your rankings? Not yet. <laughs> Hold on, sorry. Are you? What is your favorite? You name your. That's good though. That kind of tastes like salt from here. You know what? I have my. I I know what my favorite is. What? Should we put our hand over our favorite? Mm-hmm. At the end. The ultimate bitch and sauce winner. All right. So we got original Chipotle, Bombay, right? One, two, three. Really? I'm shocked. Bombay, ma'am. I'm surprised. I stand by my ranking on that. Wow. What do you like about it? Just like the curry flavor? Good, strong flavor, but not so much. Like I could eat half a tub of that too, and it, but it still has like more flavor than that. Honestly, chocolate all of these dips. All. Oh yeah, <laughs> totally. Chocolate wins everything. I think I could drink it. Mm -hmm. And I might. Go for it. Overall, I am obsessed with bitchin' sauce. Even more obsessed now than I was before this video started. I love them. I will be always having a container of the Chipotle in my fridge. We gotta figure out where you can buy the Bombay one. I know, I might have to Amazon it. And something. the chocolate. So thank you to Bitch and Sauce for sending me all of these containers. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you go buy some Bitch and Sauce because this video, you better tag me on Instagram so I can see and so that you can let me know which ones are your favorite. If you enjoyed the video, please like, subscribe, comment which one your favorite one is if you've had it. But we appreciate it, guys. Love you. Thanks See for you watching. Love you guys. See you next video. Oh yeah, we're gonna dinner, Phil. I mean, I can make it later. <laughs>